kick too. <laughs> I forgot to hit enter. <laughs> oh, well, that's okay. It all works, doesn't it? Okay, my hello. My name's Jane. J A N E. And we're going to do, I was asked to do a video on my flex knits. I don't have a lot. I have uh, six, but I do like them. So we'll start out with, make sure I'm recording. Yes, I am. Extra, extra, extra. Fine. F, P, knits. And I did forget. Pilot, why you, why I brought that from Japan years ago when I was traveling by plane. Let's see, that was my fault, not the pins. I just, you know, because this is full flex. I did get the heart on this one. Let's get some of this. I've had this knit for quite a while. I'd say about a year. There's a little heart. Got to love the little heart. Of course, the pin is um, Taylor Pins. Do you believe this is called Peach Bellini? It's something I've always... As soon as I had it, it was uh, in rotation. Okay. And that is 14K. Yeah, I think I did that. Extra fine. Flex. Not gold. Am I in the camera? Yes. I want to make sure. I'm not going to tell you who made this. Not to be mean. It's because it's no, he no longer makes it. It's, um, and I don't you guys, um, asking him. But who does, this is a flower pin. Um, I told him anything but the loo. So pine cones at each end and flowers. The real flowers are real pine cones. Isn't it gorgeous? Isn't it just plain gorgeous with a little flower? Um, that uh, Taylor Tins does make one similar. So it's nice someone filled the, the void. <laughs> Okay, next up, this is, that is not gold, so. Extra fine. Semi. Flex. FP nips. I will say I love this one. I love them all. But you know, you do, for what I do, I am a non- uh-oh. Can't add safe in the room. Dawn. This is Carolina. Pinko. This one, there is just a regular hole. This is the first one, so that's why it has a regular hole. I do upgrade instead of having the plastic housing. I forget what it's called. This is Caroline Pin Company. I did buy this um, at uh, Atlanta last year. About three of his, and they're still in rotation. They've been there, so it's been a year. I, I know I, this one I've had probably a year and a half. But, you know, I change nibs often, like I do inks. That the, the this ink has been in this pen for the whole time. So yeah, so it's beautiful. I'm going to Atlanta. Um, by the time I download this one, I'll be headed there on that Thursday. All right. Oh, and that is gold. Just so you guys know. Okay. I'm going to move this just a little, then we'll go into more. This is Flex Commander. Pin rail. 14 K ink is on the, he 
does say if you don't like it real juicy to let him know. He'll adjust. And of course, I could bring it to a pen show if it bugged me, but it doesn't. Of course, I've got the ED. Let's see, that's me again. Or it's almost out of ink. It's me again. Flix Commander Thumb Pen Grum. It's 14K. Love it. It's a juicy one. This is also, in my opinion, a juicy ink. So juicy, juicy is juicy, and that doesn't bother me. You see why I did the ink, the purplish one. Pretty cool. Love it. All right. That is for, okay, I did write that down. This is a 1.1 stab flex. Ooh, you're saying, ooh. Uh -oh. oh. Sorry. Uh oh. Can we get enough to finish this? Um, yes. Pen room. Ink is Sailor. Pen is tailored pens. Oh, that's a lot of ink, isn't it? Maybe I'll put it. No, I can't put it there. I'll put it in there. Well, hold it before I do anything. And there it is. You see the little stubby there? Love it. Like I say, I'm not a calligrapher or anything else. Pin is tailored pins. I had several of them. But so I moved them around. There we go. One more. Of course, that is not gold. This one here is. Sure, yep, yep, yep. This is a Parad Semi Flex, my newest one. I just posted a video a week ago, maybe 10 days. Um, I know it's Troublemaker Ink. Um, I only put some in it. Because I'm going to a show and I know I'm going to change this out. Oh, and this is done with the keyhole. And it. I'll be washing this um, before I go to Atlanta. So when I come back, I could just. So you can see, that's all I have in the way of flexes. Do I like them? Yes. Yes, I, actually, I like them a lot. I just, what can I say? There's not a bad thing to say about a um, flex. And don't say, oh, I don't do fancy writing. Well, either do I. I keep saying I'm going to learn. Miss Marilyn Darling on her channel shows you her free. <coughs> so you can't say, oh, the cost. Mm -mm. So what do you think? Which one's your favorite? Now, remember the extra, extra, extra thine scratching. I mean, you think it's scratching now? It was, oh, I swear it cut paper. But it is extra, extra time. But I did have Kirk from Pen Realm when I was in Atlanta, I do believe, work on it. I said, he says, that's not all I can do without destroying it. And I says, no, I know. But I says, I just want to take some of that off. A lot of people, it doesn't bother. To me, it did. So, you know, you know how it goes. But yeah, here they are. So I have three X's extra fine and another extra fine that they write differently you can see this one's a bit more thicker than this one mostly because of the type of material too and this one of course is i don't know <laughs> excuse me i have the allergies people ask you oh yeah well well and a 1.1 stab flex. If you love wide nibs, you need to get this. I'm just saying. I don't know if they're in stock. I don't. I know they weren't last time I looked. That was a month ago, or probably longer than that. Several months ago. I don't know if he's taken a waiting list. I have no idea. 
that he has, I'd get on it. Yet he loved wide nets. I love wide nets. And of course, my newest, my Marauders and my Flex, which is going to be changed out because I actually have done, I have a pin already with Turtlemaker. You know, that's sometimes it's the problem. You know, it's the problem of having so many inked. <laughs> well, it happens. See, I forgot. Anyway, so I highly recommend every one of these. I just remember the extra, extra thine, the three X's thine, will be scratchy. The end. Like they say, that is the nature of the beast with that. Other than that, I can highly recommend if you're after a semi flex, soft semi flex in 13K, the extra thine is wonderful. Flex Commander, if you don't like it so juicy, let Kirk know when you order it. And of course, the broad. I do love it. I was going to get another 1.1, 1, one, um, just regular flex, semi flex from FP Nibs, which I didn't write down there too. It's wrong. Um, that I said, I said, why would I do that when I already had the 1.1 1 .1 stud? It's not gold, but that doesn't matter. I'm not one of these ones, all oh, this and this and this. I, I don't care. If it's a good nib, that's what matters. Anyways, I want to say, <clears throat> before my voice totally gets out, I'm going to say, let's take one quick look so you can get another close up. This is a lot of fun. I mean, I have to say, actually, I think they're all a lot of fun. Now that I have the broad, I can't wait to play with it more. Yeah, I know it's out. There we go. I want to say thank you for watching and have a great day. And if you're at the Latin to Pin Show, come by and say howdy. I did post a video on the Thursday before this one. And I do have, uh, they're older, some, a lot of them from last year are uh, currently inked for that particular month. But a lot of my pins don't change out. About 55 of them never change. So come by and get one of those. Thank you for watching. You had a great day.